Mataifa mengi ya Afrika yanapoendelea kukodelewa macho na uhaba wa chakula. <tos> Rais William Ruto amesikitika kuwa mataifa haya yanaendelea kuagiza vyakula kutoka nje ya bara hili wakati ambao bara la Afrika linajivunia mashamba makubwa ambayo hayajalimwa. We import food worth close to 80 billion dollars every year to our continent a continent with 60% of arable agricultural land that is not cultivated it speaks volumes of what we need to do akisema ipo haja ya kila taifa kuweka mikakati ya kuboresha kilimo na kuyatekeleza ili kuhakikisha kuna upatikanaji wa vyakula my friends in the africa development bank They are telling us Africa's food and agriculture market could increase from US dollars 280 billion a year last year we could scale that up to a trillion dollars by 2030 if we get our act together Aidha mesikitika kutokana na jinsi mataifa mengi ya bara Afrika yanaendelea kuweka vizuizi kwenye kiingilio cha mataifa yao akipendekeza iwapo vizuizi vile vitaondolewa kutakuwepo na urahisi wa kufanya biashara na kukuza uchumi wa taifa husika as we also focus on eliminating trade barriers that impede the movement of goods that impede the movement of services across our borders to make it a reality for us to be able to trade to move goods to move services across our borders and use the borders we have as bridges for us to move our services across pia meapongeza baadhi ya mataifa ya bara Afrika yanoendelea kuondoa hitaji la visa kwa wananchi wa mataifa ya bara Afrika akisema hili litafanikisha kuongeza uwekezaji i am very happy also that more and more countries are eliminating visa requirements for countries within our continent and making it easier for investors for business people for entrepreneurs and for farmers to move across borders and grow food for us as a people amezungumza katika kikao cha umoja wa bara Afrika AU kinapoendelea Addis Ababa Ethiopia